Hey everybody, this is Brett, and yesterday I made a video entitled Why I Don't Go to Doctors, etc., etc., and then I get a comment here um, from the big tax dizzle. Don't ask me, I have no idea. He says, Oxycontin isn't bad for you. My doctor said it was okay and a miracle drug. Do you know more than a pro doctor? Okay, so let's see what Wikipedia, Wiki Answers, has to say about Oxycontin. It is a semi-synthetic opoid derived from opium and its mechanism of action is similar to morphine. It stimulates opoid receptors in the brain which can cause a person to feel euphoric or pleasurable. You may feel warm, itchy, lightheaded, dizzy, and sedated. It can also make you nauseous with the possibility of vomiting. Oxycontin abuse can lead to liver, kidney, and muscle damage along with anorexia and possibly death. Now I had a woman come to me that was taking 12 or 14 of those a day, something like that. And that was from pain because nobody ever taught her about massage and self-massage, real massage, deep tissue massage. And probably also because she had a big eBay business that was causing her a lot of strain and stress. Now there's a lot of reasons why people get into deep holes with their health. But <clears throat> all I can tell you is that what I'm writing back to this guy is that opium from poppy is natural. <clears throat> it's from the poppy seeds, from the poppy plant. They grow it in Afghanistan and other places. But these idiots, the drug companies, have changed it to be a semi-synthetic as here, as written here by Wikipedia. It's a semi-synthetic. Now, do you think that that's natural and do you think that it's healthier than the real thing? than the real thing that God created? They probably did that for manufacturing ease and for because it's cheaper. They don't want to have to buy the real thing because that costs more money probably. This is this would be my guess. Okay? This is just like why they change oils to be refined oils so that they can sit on the shelves forever. And they've probably created something that they can patent, something that's easy to manufacture and cheaper for them. And patentable. <laughs> that would be my guess as to what Oxycontin is. So, he says, do you know more than a pro-doctor? A pro-doctor. <laughs> you be the judge. I'll let you be the judge. You tell me who's the smart one and who's got the instinct, uh, the natural instinct, and who is the loser for prescribing that crap or for manufacturing that crap and allowing the public to consume it. So that's all I have to say. I've got to run to the post office and send out a bunch of packages. I Today, I did something legitimate. I did something ethical. I made millet hole pillows and body pillows and I'm sending out a massage continuing ed program to people. I've got five packages going out in the mail today. So I hope that you are doing something as well that is awesome for the world, for the earth, for humanity, for animals, etc., for the plants. Be well.